played yet. For the good of the game and the good of the women's game, he was willing to do it. So I, it's my first chance to say thank you to him. Well done, well done. Jackson Davis on a beautiful pass inside. The uh, Warriors now back up by eight. Dinwiddie, Russell. Dinwiddie's still trying to get his footing with these like this. It's his 14th game. Could be a really good addition. Alley up and Jackson Hayes. Russell with his ninth assist. Lakers right back within six. Jackson Davis kicks it out. Wiggins, nobody near him. And Wiggins can't convert. Rebound, Thompson. Lejemski steps back, corner three is good. Lejemski with his first points. He's done a lot of other things, but knocks that one down. It's a nine-point lead. We're under the two-minute mark here in the third. Again, such a big game for both these teams. Currently now in the ninth spot, the Lakers. In the tenth spot, the Warriors. Still hoping to get out of any kind of playing scenario. Dinwiddie, across some contact, shot won't go. But he'll shoot two. Upcoming national TV schedule. Monday, uh, ESPN, beating Sixers. Uh, from Philly, next will play these Warriors in San Francisco on Tuesday, NBA TV. The Nuggets and the two moves in another just huge game. It really is mentioned his 14th game since signing with the Lakers. Like that the Minnesota game. You can look at the top of the standings. They're at the top. But look at the bottom here with the Lakers and the Warriors. Still with a chance. It's not going to be easy. Lakers only have 15 games remaining. Warriors have 17 to overcome Dallas and Phoenix. But they're still hopeful. As you said, Doris, at the very top of the target, she finished 10th. You've got to win two little games just to make the playoffs. Well, uh, out to Wiggins. Wiggins again, wide open. That one's in and out. Overall, though, the Warriors, 45% from three. Russell and Hayes. Hayes, nice maneuver and in the clutch. That's a savage play from Jackson Hayes. But the footwork set it all up. Well, that, to me, with the handle, then the footwork, that's not something you see from Jackson Hayes. Thompson, meanwhile, able to connect there. Thompson had the huge first half. Now has 23 for the game. 21 of those in the first two quarters. Russell inside, fouled by Wiggins. That'll be three on Wiggins and Russell to the line. Jackson Hayes. Operating in a tight space here in this pick and roll, so he's going to catch it on the short wall. Multiple defenders around. A little crossover to a one-two slam. And the Lakers right now getting pretty much whatever they want in pick and roll. Dinwiddie's drawn a foul. Russell that time threw a foul on Wiggins. Hayes with a couple buckets. Well, the offense the, the last two months have, have been as good as it gets in the league. And Russell now another got 20 and 10. Russell can make the difference between the Lakers being a playing participant or a playoff force. So much about his scoring, but also his decision making, Mike. A lot of discussion when he plays and doesn't before. Oh, Jackson Davis. Had the mismatch down low. Another good pass. The assists were enormous in the first half. Both teams had 20 assists in the first half. It's now 29 assists for the game. We fancy move. Just couldn't finish it off with a bucket. It's been a rare recent off shooting game for Reed. Just 3 of 11. I've got 12. Shot clock turned off. No foul to give. Chris Paul flips it up and in. All some good minutes off the bench. Final seconds. Chris gets it off the time. And that will end the third. Step Curry comes alive here in this third quarter. Clay Thompson has some words for somebody over on the Laker bench. Looks like Christian Wood saying something. So we'll head to the fourth quarter. In a nine-point game, this presentation NBA Saturday continues after this message and a word from our ABC stations.